I'm going to name my features. Call this base, call this bracket. And I'm going to call this one rectangular cut. Uh, this last one will call our uh, screw. Let's just say I wanted to make this the same size bracket, but what I'm holding is actually now round stock and not square stock. So in order to create another arc here, I need to get rid of the square. If I drew an arc in this portion here, I would still have the corners. So what I can do is suppress a feature, but if I ever wanted to change this rectangle, I could also right click and edit that sketch and now I could adjust that dimension if this needed to change in size. And all of my part would change and stay the same. So there's my hole still through. But let's just say I wanted to make this a round. I'm going to suppress my rectangular cut by right clicking and suppressing this feature. Notice that I lost my hole and my timeline is grayed out. This makes sense because I drew my hole as part of the face that was cut away underneath here. So if I decide I'd like to cut away a hole, let's do that and see if we get our screw hole back. So I'm going to use a center diameter circle. I'm going to draw on this face. Now I'm going to make a 2.5 diameter circle. I'm going to extrude this through. And if I bring my timeline forward, you would think I'd get my hole, but I don't. So here's what I'm going to do. I still have my rectangular cut. I have my screw here, but I'm going to delete this feature and that sketch for the screw hole. And I'm going to roll my timeline back before this cutaway. I'll flip the part over, select center point circle, and I actually want to draw this on the plane X and Y. And now I can select my 0.25 circle. I will extrude this through my part. and hit OK. Now I can pull my timeline forward and I still have my hole and it's on the bottom. And in the future, if I'd like to go back to that rectangular cut, I can suppress this round cut and unsuppress this rectangular cut. And if you notice, I still have that screw regardless. So I've got a mean geometry and some profiles that I can change.